I'm Muriel, I'm 22 years old, and I'm from Houston, Texas. I have been overweight for as long as I can remember, but it never really got to me until I was in middle school. That's when the bullying got really bad. People were calling me fat, calling me names, and I just, I hated the way they made me feel. Even just going to school at times was really painful. So when I graduated high school a couple of years ago, I told myself that I was going to make a change. At the time, I was 160 pounds. I'm 5'4". So in my notebook, I wrote a schedule with every day of the next few months planned. My first plan was to become a vegetarian. Because I had read that if you become a vegetarian or vegan, that it can help you to lose weight faster. As to why I thought this would be a good idea, I have no clue. I I'm from an all-American Texan family, so we love our pork and our Sunday barbecues. My family, they just laughed at me and they told me I was crazy, but I was determined. For the first two weeks, I didn't eat any meat at all. I was craving it and I was feeling pretty good, but come the third week, I just felt like I was going crazy. Like, I didn't feel like myself at all. I lost a few pounds, but nothing major. And it's important to mention that I had just started college at this time, so I was super busy, stressed, and really tempted by all the fun events going on at the time. Anyway, even though I was really determined when I first started, after a few weeks, I just wanted to give it all up. I ended up caving and ate a burger after a night of partying. Even though it was so delicious, the disappointment that I felt in myself was huge. This was the beginning of my fad diet phase, as my mom called it. So after my brief time as a vegetarian, I thought running could be my new thing. Just run one mile every day. How hard can that be? Let me tell you the answer. It was hard because it's hot. It's very hot in Houston. And yeah, I'm used to it, but I've never actually tried running out in this weather, so that didn't last. Over the next few years, there were a few attempts at weightlifting, swimming, calorie reduction, but nothing stuck or worked well. I am going to be fat forever, I told myself. But then last month, my miracle came. One of my school friends told me about a program that his brother introduced him to. The Fat Decimator by Kyle Cooper. My mom, she just rolled her eyes at me, or at least I think she did when I told her over the phone. I'm three weeks in and I feel amazing. 16 pounds down. 16 pounds! I'm making this video because everyone should know how this truly works. And if I can do it, anyone can do it. And you know what? I'm just getting started.